This video is just a short extract from the entire course. If you wish to see all of the videos from this series at higher quality and in far larger screen size, head over to ifskills.com. Let's explore something called a mat. And a mat is similar to an alpha channel in that it performs transparency issues based on an object. However, mats are separate from the actual clip or the still. They're separate items. We did one of these kind of similar to this a little bit earlier. I've got a still up here that I did in Photoshop and I call it sprayed strokes. So it's a mat of basically white and black. I want to apply it to this image to give it that unique looking border. We'll drag it down, put it right on top of that bad boy. And of course we have to composite it because we're dealing with solid black and white. Since we want to remove the white, which one is it? It's multiply. We're going to right click on sprayed strokes TIFF and we're going to go into composite mode and say multiply. And there you go. This is a still image. It's not a video. However, you could have put a video right underneath that thing and had the same effect with that same type of border. So that's a Photoshop thing. You can make these really kind of fun Photoshop masks and bring them in as mats. The next one I'm going to show you is actually a video. And that's, not, don't you like it when you stop a video and your face is in the most embarrassing position it ever could be in? If I press my right arrow key a couple of times, maybe I could look a little bit better before we get started. I brought this video in and I hit it with the desaturate. So it looks a little older in a sense. I then went into a program called Live Type and I made a little movie I call Aged. And if I open it up, you can see like an old video clip, you know, old movie kind of stuff with all the scratches and things on it. Remember, that was done in a program that creates a mat automatically. So when I drag this over, we won't have to do any compositing. It'll be ready to go. And you can see, now let's do this. Let's play it once and see if we like it. Interesting, but I think the effect is a little bit too intense. So let's, I'll tell you what, let's do this. Let's go into effects. Let's go into video filters. Ooh, let's go into blur. I think it just needs to be softer, that's all. Let's hit it with just a, a plain old Gaussian blur right there. Drag it on top. Actually, it looks better already. Let's double click it, bring it up here, and go into the filter. Maybe give it even a little bit more radius, which means more blur. We don't need those solid white lines. Let's see what that looks like. Yeah, I, I think I do like that a little bit better. It's not long enough. We can do this. I'm going to hold down the Alt key to make a copy of it and bring it over. Remember, let go of the Alt key before you place it right here. Then we can hold the Alt key down again, and we can bring another one, let go of the Alt key, and place it right there. And we'll pull this one in, just snap it nice and pretty, and there you go. Aging using a mat. And then this one, putting a really nice border around an image. All done in Final Cut Pro, just using a mat.